Well, we've been talking about it all morning long. Today is the last day on the air here for our own George Mallet after a decade. Yeah, 10 years. Yeah. 10 years here at Fox 29. So George, it's only fitting that we take a look back at some of your great moments over the years. Are you ready for this one? No, I'm not. No. I'm taking over Good Day Philadelphia. My name is George Mallet. Yep, that's it. Take it over. It's my show now. Our good friends on the 10 o'clock news also wanted to tell everyone about our plans on Friday, but they apparently don't know the name of our show. On Good Morning Philadelphia, everything you need to know. The good name morning, of the show is Good Day Philadelphia. In Camden, George Mallet, Fox News. Hey, Don Tollefson ever had to shave his legs? <laughs> I think the grass skirt hurts my credibility. No, not at all. Okay. I didn't realize how small he was until he came up here. He's 17 hands high. He is absolutely a superb physical specimen. And George, you are 17 and a half hands high. Yes, I am. And a superb specimen in and of yourself. <laughs> Trying like heck anyway. <laughs> I think I'm getting in trouble right now. Uh, I I love when it. I get to Milwaukee, I'm going to grow back the Anchorman hair. I think you should. Well, yep. you're lucky you have a versatile head. I have a versatile <laughs> head and Propecia, so I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, the thing you don't know about George is that he is one of the best writers I've oh, ever met in the you. business. A fabulous writer and one of those rare talents that can do the hard news stories and let us know what's going on with all the credibility grass skirt accepted um, and and goof around too and and uh, and when we love you well love thank you, you. I love and you too Sue we're um, happy for him David but we're sorry for ourselves and and I've only been here <laughs> for two party years but on I, Monday. <laughs> I, I was gonna say Sue I've only been here two years and George has had an impact even on me you know it's amazing he was one of the best storytellers in my opinion on the yep. Barbro story because yep. we all know he has such a love for horses yeah. So George, that's a fair. That's that. I only started that horse thing once I got uh, on Good Day Philadelphia. Though he found his passion. Yes, yeah. you did. Yes, you yeah. did. Let's get a quick weather here and get you uh, out the door. Temperature.